heute hier im Vlog. Ach, krass. Hallo. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to the vlog. from Tokyo. Today is the 16th of November and I've already been here for two weeks. It feels like a really long time but also like I just came yesterday. I've only now had the time to touch the vlog camera because we've been working a lot, sh shooting different projects and also, I didn't really have jet lag the first days, but I feel like I had like a delayed jet lag because the last four days were just, I was so tired the whole time and couldn't really move. Yesterday, I spent the whole day in bed. I felt really guilty because, you know, I want to do cool stuff every day. And today I'm feeling pretty great. And also the sun's back out today. I'm in my little airbnb which is pretty small it's pretty good i started the day with some editing i got my films back from the lab um and it's really i'm really happy with the results we shot something really cool for ysl and then i had like three different jobs and yeah now i have to decide what i'm gonna do with this beautiful day because the sun sets in like four hours but yeah i just wanted to say hi and i hope that i'll find the time the next seven days i still have seven days left to take you with me last time i came here we only stayed for six days i think five or six days because it was more like a stopover on the way to shanghai and this time I'm here for three weeks and I have all this time, but I feel like I have no time at all. Now my laundry is finished and I'm going to hang that up in this bathroom dryer that I think is really cool. <laughs> and then I'm going to get dressed and leave the house, try to find some late breakfast. And yeah. So I got myself a little 7-Eleven snack and I'm just gonna sit here for a little bit and enjoy the weather. Find a spot. I usually always say I don't feel comfortable talking in public to the vlog camera. Well here it's even more uncomfortable because everyone's just very silent. <laughs> What do you think? What is it? Sugar. <laughs> the Anzen! Oh, cute! Oh, they're sick! Casually bathing. Hi, guys. Um, I decided to give myself some freckles. Let's hope they turn out well. Because I always feel better when I have them. So, and I felt really unpretty the last couple days I'm packing stuff right now because we're taking a little trip tomorrow I have to get up really early and because we're taking the train to Kyoto I'm really excited but also 
yeah, it's just very early call time and I have to decide what to bring because I don't want to pack too heavy because I have to carry everything with me. So I decided against the Super 8. I'm going to focus on Super 8 on Sunday because we're taking another trip on Sunday. So I'll only bring the contacts and the vlog cam and then power bank um, and three different films, one Kodak Gold, one Portra 400, and one Sinister 400. Also, I'm very happy I brought all these goddamn batteries and I don't need them. I brought my both of my Olympus, which I have not touched at all. And I kind of knew this beforehand. I have eye drops, tampons, chewing gum, normal lip balm. I'm gonna brush my teeth and go to sleep and I'll see you tomorrow. We made it. Little struggle on the way. We're on the train. And we're so fast. Guten! Currently having lunch in the Moss Burger. Um, veggie option, great. Good. I took it remote. Hi. Hello there. Um, please don't mind the laundry and don't mind my looking like my being. Um, I filmed with the Super 8. I tried to film with the Super 8. It was tough. Um, so if the footage turned out well and I already have it, you'll see it now. If not, we'll just go to tomorrow basically <laughs> and I'll have my instant noodles. I wanted a bed Tell the story or it goes Tell the story or it goes Full time You talk your money up While it's living in a coal mine Full time to call your mind It's a new day. I am s super sleepy still. Um, I did some work this morning right when I woke up. I want to go to the photo lab and drop the films from yesterday um, to still get them developed while here. And then um, I think I'm gonna meet the other. I'm gonna meet the other guys in Shibuya and maybe eat something there. I'm gonna wear my tabbies.
We're heading out. wrong but my eyes just hurt every single day whenever we're doing something maybe it's the air conditioning or just my sleep but it makes me feel really tired know how I hate talking to the camera in public well now I'm in this little parking lot on the side of the street and I feel comfortable talking here so I checked out of my Airbnb this morning and brought all my stuff to the hotel that I'm staying in for tonight I'm leaving tomorrow evening and then I went to pick up my negatives from the last uh, film rolls because I need to rescan everything once I get back home and then I walked around just you know doing a little bit of stuff and then I thought okay right next to my hotel was this amazing vegetarian vegan ramen option I had last time when I came here and I just went there and they said it's sold out for today and I'm really sad because I planned my whole day around having food there which is super sad so now I have to think what I can eat now because I still have like 45 minutes until I can check into the hotel and I'm extremely tired and I don't know I slept really bad but I'll try find a food option now sounds like I'll have another onigiri from the 7-eleven <laughs> I made it to the hotel I actually wanted to stay here for the whole time just because I really liked it last time I came here um, it's just a very basic hotel but it's like old school and cute. It's it's so cute. <laughs> I don't know why, but I have a thing for this. I mean, look at this. Look at this little console here. It's really pretty. It's really nice. I actually took a photo. I think it was this building um, four years ago that I absolutely love. And yeah, it's just it's nice. And the sun is out. And the sun. This would make a great picture right now, I gotta be honest. Oh. Oh. So. Last night will be a wig night. We're gonna have dinner, last dinner together. And then we, I think we want to try to go to a karaoke bar. They were like, okay, we meet in like 40 minutes. And I was still, you know, um, admiring the view. Wasn't ready to leave. It's so pretty. I can't sing. <laughs> okay, so we came here and asked for one specific room, and the guy was like, Yeah, yeah. And then we paid, and then the other guy was like, No, it's busy. So now we're in this. In this. Dark room. In this dark room. <laughs> it's like backside of Kit Kat Club. It's it's like my bathroom. Welcome to my show. 
What an experience, guys. <laughs> um, this was my first time ever doing karaoke. And honestly, I thought I'd be much better. Not the singing, like the, the actually getting the notes right, I know, I knew was not going to happen. But, you know, we, we did songs that I thought I could do a hundred percent from scratch and then all of a sudden you're just like oh my god i'm failing it's so hard yeah but anyways this was so fun we booked the room for an hour and then we ended up staying two hours and yeah it was really fun morning Kind of cute the guy from yesterday who told me that it sold out recognized me right when i walked into the shop and was like veggie veggie hi <laughs> um so i ordered it but i have to say they definitely changed the menu uh when i came here four years ago it was like a veggie tonkatsu it was really like milky and creamy um and they changed it but even though i didn't get what i expected it was still really good and now I'm really sweaty because it was super hot in there and oh, I'm so happy I had some good food today <laughs> uh, the sky is blue the sun the sun is out um, I still have like six hours to, to kill Like my father to both. 